the NHS rightly focused on COVID patients, and it has meant, sadly, that the, the waiting list has, has risen significantly. And I, and I have to tell you, I think the waiting list is going to continue to rise for a while until it starts to fall. And the reason... So what? Uh, we, we can't be sure. And the reason is because we estimate about 8 to 9 million people stayed away from the NHS because they were asked to. They did the right thing. But we want them to come back. We, I want them all to come back uh, because I want them to know the NHS is there, it's open uh, for them. But as they do, of course, that's going to create more pressure. And my job, the NHS's job, is to, to get through that elective backlog, that COVID backlog, as quickly as we can. And what we're announcing today is that part of that plan will include a new online service. It's called My Planned Care. And it will mean that every individual on the waiting list in England will be able to see online exactly where they are on the waiting list, what the average weight is in their area, and other information about how they can prepare for their treatment. The importance of this is that, understandably, many people will be anxious and stressful you know, about their position on the waiting list. It's perfectly understandable, and we want to provide as much transparency as possible. I was reading in my Telegraph newspaper this morning that the uh, plan is the NHS backlog plan is not coming today because you've hit a roadblock with the Treasury. Well, it's not coming today because we had a roadblock with Omicron. Uh, Omicron, I had actually planned to publish the plan in, in December and we were almost there. We're agreeing it finally with the NHS and, and across government. Uh, but because of Omicron, we rightly changed our focus, especially to, to boosters and to, to folks of that. And I, I, we obviously did the right thing. It makes us now the freest country in Europe. And we're heading the other side of Omicron. Okay. But we will publish the plan shortly. The